I was working with a client recently, helping her to figure out how to describe the work that she does with her clients uh, or the work that she wants to do. And the exercise was so simple and helpful that I thought I would, I would share it here with you. I, this is a short version of it. Uh, if you want a longer version, go check out my Facebook live video from March 15th today, March 15, 2019. Anyway, so it starts with, with very simply this. And I'm going to give you a few seconds after each question to pause if you want to and comment below if you like. Who knows, somebody watching this video or uh, seeing the comments might actually be your ideal client or, or be a referral source. So the first question is, imagine the person who is so meant to work with you as a client. Uh, they are just at the, the right time and place in their life. Uh, they're struggling with certain issues and challenges or they have certain yearnings and, and, they're, they, and they would resonate so much with just who you are. They resonate with your style, the way you talk, the way you think, your energy. Um, and you, you like them too. You just really enjoy working with someone like them. So what is that person like? Describe that person in any way, whether it's you know gender, age, profession, uh, what do they look like, what, what, what do they sound like, anything that helps you to imagine that person. So I'm going to give you a few seconds now to comment below, to pause this, comment below if you like, or just to reflect on it. Go ahead. All right, so now that you've gotten this person in your mind and heart, now the question is, they come and work with you. Now they're your client and you are so happy and they're really happy because you're just the right provider for them and they're like, they seem like the, the perfect client. Now, now you're doing the work with them. So what are you actually doing with that client? If you meet with them in sessions, just talk about what you're actually doing with them. What are you helping them out with? Uh, what exercises are you working on with them? Uh, what are you talking about with them? Uh, what are they doing in the session with you? Talk about that. What is it that you're actually doing with them? And again, I'll give you 10 seconds now to reflect on that or to comment below. All right. Now, Imagine that this client is now completing their work with you. Maybe it's been a year of working with you. Maybe it's been three sessions. I don't know what your, pa your ideal package is, but they've, they're now completing their work with you. How would they describe, gosh, I am so grateful for you and this work that we've done together because, fill in the blank, how are they, how are they talking about, gushing about the work that they've done with you? Go ahead and take a few seconds now to reflect on that or pause and comment below. Okay. Anything else that you've noticed is different about them? Is there anything different about their life or their, their work, their relationships, their health? Anything that came out of a result of, of working with you? Uh, was there a particular problem that they came in with that you're now realizing they've resolved it now? Um, a goal that they've achieved that they may, may have not even have realized that they've achieved that goal or they know how to do something now and, and it's so obvious to them now that, 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 but to them it's so obvious, but now you can see that change in them. So what is it? Any other changes that you want to, you want to comment about? Note that below. Go ahead. I'll give you a few seconds. Okay, finally, let's talk about what that client was going through before they came to work with you. I know it's a bit strange to put this at the end, but um, sometimes it's hard for people to think about the, the ideal client, what they were going through before. What they're, but now that you've journaled about all these things, hopefully the before picture is, is, is a bit easier for you now. So tell me about why that client decided to come and work with you. Uh, what was the, was there some kind of triggering event in their life, in their health, in their relationships, in their, was there a particular conflict? Was there a realization that they had? 
Was there a new goal, a, a new dream? Um, was was it a chronic issue that finally got to be too much? What was it that got them to finally say, "I need to pay for the service"? <laughs> you know, I need to I need to do something about this. Uh, again, I'll give give you a couple seconds to reflect on this. Okay, so what you've done now, if you've been writing this stuff down, is you have just drafted your work with me page, web page, or your services web page. And this is just a first draft, so I invite you to put this first draft away for a day or a week, and then come back to this exercise and do it again the second time without looking at the first draft. So that you might have any new ideas that come to you, it might be some of the same stuff, and that's okay too. But do a second draft without looking at the first one after a day or a week. Okay. After you've done the second draft, answering these same questions again, put that away for a day or a week, and then come back and the third time, you integrate the two drafts that you've written. You some phrases or sentences you like from draft one, great. Put that into the third draft. Something you like from the second draft, great. Put that into the third draft. And as you integrate these things, you now have something that you can work with. You can reorder things, edit it some more, of course, and then present it to your audience and get their feedback on it. Your ideal clients, your potential clients who are uh, open to giving you feedback that you don't mind asking them for feedback. Well, put this into a Google document, for example. Uh, click on share, anyone with a link can comment and, and, and just invite their comments or just put it on a Facebook post, simple, and say, hey, what do you think about this? I'm, I'm refreshing the way I describe how I work with clients. Does this resonate with you? Do you have any questions? Uh, is there anything that's confusing? Is there anything you would, you would uh, suggest changing? And try that out. And you might even get a couple of new clients this way, um, but certainly it will help you to hone how you describe what you do and it's something that, you know, this is an exercise that I do encourage you to come back to over, over the years because your authentic business, the thing that you do that is your calling, is going to keep changing at least a little bit. It'll keep changing over time as you evolve yourself and the, as the market evolves too. I hope this is helpful and I look forward to any comments you want to uh, put below and um, may this be helpful to you. All right, take care.